Hello guys, I'm back with another brand new video. My name is Aris and you're watching Possible Now. So guys, as you know, RDR1 is out on PC and many of the players face different kind of errors. So in this video, I'm going to guide you about how to fix all of these issues like DX error, D3D, um, unspotted adopter, a lot of errors uh, people face. So I'm going to discuss that how you can fix all of these issues so watch the video till the end and if you are new on the channel kindly subscribe to the channel and like this video share to your friends and without any waste of time let's start the video so guys first of all uh, we need to apply dx12 method so for this uh, you need to check my description um, where you find the mega dx12 uh, file uh, just simply download the file in a mega pack and once you download it then simply right click on it and extract here once you extract the file then open the folder and you can see there is only one file in this folder named dx12 so mostly people use um, dx11 or dx12 version so that's why they face um, that kind of issues so that's why we need to apply the extra double click on it open the x12 and accept the agreement click to next install the bing bar it's optional so it's up to you click to next and wait for a minute it takes few seconds and it's done now click to finish and now launch your game and check your problem is solved or not method number two is switch the api if that doesn't work then try switching the API you can use either Vulkan or DX12 to launch the game here's how you can do it open documents on your PC go to Rockstar games RDR1 and settings find the XML file named system right click it and choose edit press ctrl plus F on your keyboard and type API and hit find next once you find it uh, change dx12 to welcome then go to file save as save confirm and yes that's it method number three is adjust your page file size first up you will need to change your page file size to give the game enough resources to run here's how right click on the windows start button and go to system Click on Advanced System Settings. In the Advanced tab, go under Performance and hit Settings. In Performance Options, go to Advanced again, then look for Virtual Memory and click Change. You will see a box checked that says Automatically Manage Paging File Sizes for All Drives. So uncheck it, then choose Custom Size. Here's how to calculate what you enter in these blanks. So, for initial size, physical memory x 1000 x 1.5, maximum size physical memory x 1000 x 3. For example, if you have 32 GB of your RAM in your PC, here's how it looks. Initial size 32 x 1000 x 1.5 equal to 48000, and maximum size 32 x 1000 x 3 equal to 96000. Make sure to replace 32 with the amount of RAM you have. Enter these numbers, click set, then hit OK all the way out. Try launching your game again. So guys, that's it for today and uh, I hope these methods work for you. And uh, if you're new on the channel, please like, share and subscribe my channel for more content. And uh, we will meet in the next one. Until then, peace out.